<laughs> right, so tell us, where's your favourite place to eat in Peckham? Right, my favourite place to eat in Peckham, and that is coming from me, yeah. Sandy, Gogglebox and Big Brother Big House. You get me? <laughs> I also love to keep humble, stay grounded, be safe, and I hope you're all doing the same thing. But if you want something to eat in Peckham, you need to come to... <laughs> A few weeks ago, Uber Eats got in contact with us and said, hey, do you want to make a video on Top Jaw's Guide to Peckham? And we're like, yeah, of course we want to do that. And over the next five minutes, show you some of our favorite places to eat and get the people behind those places on camera. First early morning stop of our top class guide to Peckham. Paired letters every day, all day dining. The head chef here used to work in Rules, which is like one of the oldest restaurants in the UK. So on the weekends, this place is pretty Sergio Ramos with queues around here. Everybody want that hangover breakfast. On the Riviera. Well, Peckham, but. Oh, shit. Steak. We'll start with this thing here. This is a steak sandwich, charcoal steak, onion chutney, brioche bun, like a load of mayo, which is really, really important. We've then got the weekender. Frizzle chicken, which is their fried chicken, which looks ungodly. This is awesome. It tastes so nice. <laughs> Peddler delivered their sandwiches and burgers. So this little gem here, you can get on Uber Eats. Next we go to Nandine, but I'm gonna take him a little gift. I'm gonna order one of those uh, grilled steak sandwiches with attitude sauce, obviously. But you change your menu like every few days, right? Or every yeah, week, every, yeah, the dinner menu. Yeah, a couple menu. of times a week. Yeah, a couple of times a week, if not every day. Thanks so much, man. It's been no great. Worries. Brilliant. See you soon. Mate, this is awesome. It's, look at the weather. Unlucky we. Nandi. This is run by a really, really hardworking Kurdish family. Parry, the mum, is the cook. Her sons do like the business of marketing. Their dad tiled the place and designed all the interior. Have you had Kurdish food before? It's not that common, but it sure is good. <laughs> Whoa, Parry. That's mitmaze, and that's sujuk God, that's good. Look at that. Look at how much color and like, such vibrant food. Baklava. Do you know what back of her is? Hello. Next up, we're going to Lords of Pokey, and we're going to get send them seven spice chicken shard and a sandwich. Thank you, man. I know you're thinking. Eh, wait a second, that's basically like a multi-story car park. Well. It is. So this whole building is full of like offices, studios, food places here. They do community events there. There's like a girls' festival going on that we did not know about. This place is like a semi-permanent place. They're trying to extend the lease. But what we're here for is Lords of Pokey. These guys. Probably the worst Uber Eats delivery guys you've ever seen. <laughs> but we bought you some stuff from Nandine. Yeah. Seven spice chicken sandwich. What do you know? Yeah. So that our base is going to be so sushi rice. You can, you can choose. You can the best. choose. This is oh no, the choice. Yeah. Uh, and so this would cost nine pounds fifty. This is a large bowl. And everything is available on Uber Eats. Right. So I'm going to go for a little bit of, a bit of salt and pepper. <laughs> Do we dig deep? That the <laughs> fat chunks of tuna as well. Yeah. The multi-story car park that is now a multi-use space. There's Frank's Bar like right at the top. If you haven't been to Frank's Bar? Go there when there's a sunset. Just do it. We're kind of approaching the sunset hours now. Look at that view out there. That was awesome. There's another place you should probably check out. It's a bit of a trek away, but we want to show you it anyway. Uh, here we are, it's drums and flats. Well, that was a bit of a trek, wasn't it, Will? Tangy buffalo with blue cheese sauce and spicy barbecue. I'm really hoping that they've given me gloves, you know, just for the mess. Get me, Bubba. Oh, that will make your eyes water. So that was it, a day in Peckham. I think a highlight for me was the frizzle chicken this morning at Pedlo. Boys, wasn't that amazing? Oh. Oh. Meeting Sandy from Gogglebox. I mean, starstruck.com forward slash me. And if you don't really like the look of any of the places we've been to, I mean, the food's been great at all of them, but remember, 
everything's available on Uber Eats. So if you don't fancy going sitting in a multi-story car park, you can get it delivered to your own home, which is perfect. We've been Top Jaw. This has been Peckham. Good night and God bless. Thank you.